Hey, hey, Steph here. So how do you choose between an SQL versus a NoSQL database? When should you use one or the other? Simple answer. If your data, the data that you're tracking for your application has complex relationships, then you want to use an SQL-based database. SQL-based database, another word for that is a relational database because it is a database, a base of data, that's designed to create relationships between chunks of data, chunks of information stored in that database. You use a NoSQL database if you don't need to track relationships between pieces of data. Examples of that might be hits on a website. In terms of data that has complex relationships, that might be an e-commerce shop where you have clients who have one or many orders and who may have purchase one or many products, multiples of particular products. You see there's a lot of complexity in terms of the orders they make, when they made that order, how many items they buy, etc. That's an example of data that has lots of relationships. Whereas if you're just tracking hits on a website, no relationships there, that's pretty straightforward, simple. That's where no SQL can come in. Final point, a lot of people in the last few years, a lot of noob nerds, they kind of have migrated towards no SQL because it's just easier to set up and understand versus an SQL-based database. But they soon run into problems when they realize that there's a reason why SQL-based databases, relational databases, have been around for a few decades now. They're powerful and effective.